home for the holidays? Liven it up with some science. Mix baking soda and vinegar in a cup and let it fizz. Carefully pour the gas that bubbled up into another cup. It should look like you're pouring nothing. Try pouring a regular empty cup over a candle. It's gonna look silly. Now try the gas cup. It puts out the candle. We made CO2 gas with the baking soda and vinegar and it stayed in the cup because it's more dense than air. When you pour it over the candle, it deprives the flame of oxygen and the fire goes out. When you get tired of wrapping presents, stick the tape you're using to a smooth surface and pull it off quickly to build up a static charge. When pulled off of the same surface, two strips of tape should build up the same charge and then repel each other. When you stick one piece to the other and then rip them apart, they should now attract because they'll have opposite charge. Take those random holiday balloons lying around the house and rub them against your hair or against a holiday sweater to rip off electrons and build up static charge. Now move the charged balloon around some tinsel or confetti and the light weight of the tinsel will be affected by the static. You could even remove all the tinsel after Christmas this way. We but wish you a merry Christmas. Don't like the party music? Make a kazoo out of your straw, applying the property of resonance in an open tube. Cut off the bendy part of a straw. Flatten about two inches on one side of the straw. On the end, cut a V shape. Now blow through the V shape, squeezing the straw a little bit to squish it. It takes some practice, but you'll eventually achieve an annoying buzzing sound. As you cut the straw, the pitch or resonant frequency will go up. Oh dear. While cooking your favorite holiday meal, heat up the pan. Once it gets nice and hot, drop some water onto the surface. You'll notice the Leiden frost effect. The drops roll around like an air hockey puck because the heat is causing the water on the bottom of the droplet to boil so fast, it creates a cushion of vapor for the droplet to float on, rolling on water. <laughs>